All right, what's up, fellas? Back at you again. We out here nice and early in the morning. We're gonna do something a little different. Something probably none of y'all might know about. So I live in Alabama, right? I'm about to do something you might not know about. You see this right here? This nice little river? It's got a rainbow trout in it. Yeah, that's right. Rainbow trout. It's below Smith Lake Dam, Sipsy River. But we're gonna get out here and see if we can catch us some old rainbows. I was gonna keep a couple. My idiot self ran off and forgot the cooler because you can keep five and they are good eating. Done it before. So, special treat for you guys. Stick with me. Let's get out. But, yeah, guys, so um, if you come up here, you can only drive up so far and you get to the pumping station. But you can park at a designated area by the pumping station, walk around it like I did, walk all the way up to the dam and, uh, drop off at random spots and fish. And oh yes, this is looking better. In my experience, the shallower spots with current rolling through that has just one or two little deep holes in them are usually the best. Oh yes. Now, right in here somewhere, I'm not real sure where, somewhere in here, I caught a monster of a rainbow trout. I got a picture of it and uh I'll stick it on the screen for y'all. But yeah, I caught a caught a begging. I was pretty excited about it, needless to say. I was with my best friend and his cousin, who's now one of my best friends. And uh yeah they were throwing fly gear and I was throwing a rooster tail. So why well, I throw a conventional tackle. I don't have the time or patience for flight. I told myself before I left the house I should have brought some of them Berkeley power baits or stopped and bought some salmon eggs or something. And I thought, nah, I'll just throw this artificial. It'll be just fine. I hope it doesn't come back to bite me in the rear end. Wonder what that was. That didn't look like a trap. Like skipjack. <laughs> this place is completely free, guys. I mean, you don't gotta have any kind of special permits or anything. Just as long as you've got a state issued fishing license, you can come up here and catch as many as you want. You can keep five. Career limits five a person. Uh, Alabama Power stocks this. I don't know why. I guess for the people of Alabama, but uh, I think they stock it monthly, if I'm not mistaken. But the, I think that Riverside Fly Shop does guide trips and all kinds of other stuff, float trips, or you can come up here and walk it, however you want to do it, bring your own canoe, I don't know. Boys and girls, I got one. He's little, but I got one. Pulling it down river. Wet my hand. Look at here. Look at here, look at here. Would you look at that? Beautiful little rainbow trout. Told y'all they were in here and you can come catch them for free. Bye bye. Caught him on the brown and of course, wasn't recording when it happened. Murphy's Law. Murphy's Law. I was burning it and I was pulling it down river. I don't think there's any size limit. It's just only that you can keep five. So, you know, be aware of that. I don't know. But yeah, if you guys want to come do this, it can, it can be a challenge. Uh, well, I've had some some skunks out here, but I've also had some days where you come out here and catch them a lot. But that's also because I don't know trout fishing. I don't know what triggers them, how to go. I just know rooster tail. Oh, I should have brought that real tiny jerk bait I got at the house. I bet it would have worked great. It's for saltwater fishing, for catching small bait fish to take out for big fish. I bet it would have worked. 
logically. But, eh, I did. There's a lot of bird poop right in here, which makes me think maybe there's a lot of fish right in here. So let's throw right out across here. Son of a doo, doo All right, guys, I noticed there was one over next to that tree and he was kind of sitting there, kind of, I don't know, he wasn't doing like the rest of them. And I threw up there and I got him and he's a big one. But if you look at him here, he's a, he's a little messed up. I don't know, I, I don't know what just happened. Like, uh, he was kind of sitting there and he was laid up kind of sideways, I guess. And uh, I threw over there and gave it one or two reels and twitched it and uh, he smoked it. And then when he smoked it, that was all there was to it. There was, he didn't do nothing after that. He smoked it, he hit it, and then he just stopped. And judging by how messed up he is, Got a hole in the top of his head there. Goodness. I'm betting he got washed down into a tree or something and smoked. So, I mean, I don't know what to do with him. Maybe he live, I don't know. I don't know what that was, that was weird. He meandered off, you can't see him anymore. He's deep and just kind of sitting there. Maybe, I, I guess he's gonna make it. I don't know. I don't know if that's when he was, uh, when they turned the water on last night, if he just got pushed into a pile and stabbed by a stick or somebody did that to him or what. Like I said, he was, he was over next to that tree. He was like kind of on his side, but not really. And I pulled it past him two or three times and he turned and looked at it and I landed it right in front of him one time and he just reached out and smoked it and that was all there was to it. No fight. I mean, he kind of fought. I just, I don't know, it was weird. Real, real weird. All right, guys, benefits of having a dirty truck is that, uh, look what I found. So I'm gonna cheat. Well guys, that's gonna do it. Not a great day. I've had some worse days up here though. Uh, only caught two. Don't know that that one counted, but uh, he was big. And then there at the end, I was getting lit up. They just weren't getting it. Well, I'm not gonna be able to do an outro because I gotta no move. One thing with trout, I gotta, I gotta don't get be going. afraid to throw off. So, and what looks like some crazy current because you'll get bit like I just did. Just, I think I'm gonna have to because I'm so fat and out of breath. I don't feel like doing it, and y'all hearing it and making fun of me. So, this is.